Hello. I don't know why I do this to myself, but you guys are coming with me today. First thing you learn about me with a day in the life is the fact that I never, ever make my bed. It's a waste of time, I'm busy, got things to do. On an ideal day, I get a workout in and listen to some 90s rap. And it's only 9.30. It's a real life moment. You know, you guys saw, I went to the gym. This is what a typical lunch for me looks like. No, not disgusting. It's soup, pea soup, boring. No, fun, locale. I need lunches that are fast and okay, day in the life. It's kind of hard to remember to film a day in the life because usually I'm just working and not documenting, but that's Jared. Jared, say hi. Hey. Jared, what do, you, what do you do? Uh, I shoot videos and I get hurt. <laughs> Jared got in a skateboarding accident and he got staples in his leg. And he was telling me about it, but I have a really weak stomach. So even when people tell me gross stories without showing me anything, I'm like such a baby and I'm like, ooh, don't tell me anymore. But today we are, um, what are we doing? We're shooting three videos. Wait, where am I supposed to look? Do you know where the um, where I'm supposed to look when I'm filming myself? Woo! That little dot underneath the... This? No, the left. This. That little dot. Oh. That little tiny one. Oh, okay. <laughs> so newsflash, everyone. I do not shoot or edit any of my videos. You know why? Because you would never watch them. I mean, I clearly can't even um, shoot a phone video, <laughs> much less camera. So this is my second bedroom in my house that I have converted, you guys have seen this if you've seen my um, my videos before, but I've converted it into a closet space. We had it built out with these, oh my God, this is, this is deadly. Talk about going to the hospital or getting hurt. That will poke your, poke your eye out, kids, or mine. This is a closet that I had built in, and then we have over there. So it just looks pretty, it looks, grand but honestly because it's just the back wall i feel like it's i could use more space but i think doesn't everyone feel like they have a bigger closet than they have yeah i'll stand in but i just need to show the reality usually when i shoot my videos like i look presentable from here up but down low it's nasty <laughs> these are like high terrain slippers these are ones that you could go grocery shopping in but i wouldn't so when you guys watch my videos, this is the setup. I mean, it's actually a pretty small room, but I've just like maximized the space. So I have my rack here. I have my cactus friend, closet, all. Look at, look at what we do. This is, um, yeah, yep. That is some scotch tape right there. Pretty much turn that on. And that's how we record the audio. You know what? It's called improvising. It's called, not spending money on something. <laughs> it's called saving thousands of dollars. It's called saving money. So when we shoot at my house and not at my shooting studio, my bathroom becomes my dressing room. And uh, just gotta make sure well, I don't fall in the toilet. Jeez. Typical Lindsay move. Schedule the cleaning lady the day we're shooting videos. I'm so We're having so much fun. It's a blast. He loves it. Third video down, now we're shooting in my room. I always have these little palms in my room because it just feels, well by the way, they stay alive for six weeks where flowers die in me. So that's a little tip. I'm gonna figure out, there's a word for it. I can't remember it because it's like real fancy word. Jared's gone, I cleaned up a little bit. Changed into just a little bit of a casual outfit. Is it casual? What do you guys think? It's like casual, sexy, almost showing a boob. But, <laughs> nothing about um, I'm headed downtown to go fabric shopping. Isn't this appropriate? I'm almost gonna have a nip slip. Okay, phase two of the day. I get in and I get so happy. Tupac's already playing. No, I'm headed downtown LA to find some fabrics for something I'm making and uh, it's 1.45, so let's see if the traffic gods are on my side. 
traffic in LA is just makes you crazy. There we go. Fabric heaven. I actually hate the fabric store. It's so overwhelming. Look at this. How are you ever supposed to figure out what you like when you just are over sensitized? Is that a word? It's just a lot. Uh, this is a first. I gotta go to the bathroom. I gotta put a quarter in there. All right. It's a little weird. Ugh. And I don't know if this is TMI. The only thing worse than a bathroom with no toilet paper and no soap is a bathroom that doesn't have anything to wipe your hands. They have this air thing. Like that doesn't protect you from the people who don't wash their hands and go to the bathroom and open the door and their grimy shit hands. So you know what I do? I always take the seat covers. This is TMI, I'm just showing you. This is a day in the life, you know? This is, I keep looking at the wrong, I'm showing you the real deal. Lindsay situation, Lindsay annoyances. All right, so stylists and designers would curse me, but this place, like the rows and rows of stuff and the doctor's office waiting room music, I'm feeling tired. <laughs> I'm honestly feeling tired. And the lighting is terrible. The lighting is so bad. So this is downtown, the fabric district. There's just like fabric all over the place. In alleys, whoop, gonna get ran over. There we go. Look, it's just everywhere, which makes it really hard to make any decision. Oh, the sparkles are calling me, look out for an eye. No, I don't, I don't really wear many sparkles. Okay, so we're just gonna go in the alley because I forgot to tell you guys about this. So. Madewell jeans, these jeans that I just got, I love them so much. They don't really stretch out and they have like that perfect high rise without like feeling like you have like a flat ass, you know, and like, you know. And also, so from Madewell and then these, this is not sponsored at all. I just literally scored and I wanna share it with you guys. Look at, they have such a great jewelry designer. Look at these babies. God, I love them so much. They feel really expensive and they were like 25 bucks. So um, yeah, made well jeans and jewelry. I don't really wear much else from there, but I was just so impressed. Okay, now I gotta pay attention because I almost got ran over twice. Okay, I went across the street. They're playing Beyonce here. I feel so much better. Oh, look at all the beautiful stuff. This is boring. This is a boring day in the life. I'm sorry. Okay, that's enough fabric shopping for today. Now I'm waiting for my assistant because I found a cool wall. This is the life of an influencer. I found a cool wall, blue, white, stripe. I mean, the color palette is happening. And you know, she's gonna come over. We're gonna park in the alley and then I'm gonna obnoxiously have her take a million photos until I get a good one. Yep. Sorry, I just had my assistant come and get me chocolate and she got me a lot. Um, come over here for a second. I know, I don't mean to put you on the spot. But um, I'm doing a day in the life, my first one ever for my YouTube channel. Hello. And this is Cameron. Hi. And Cameron and I have worked together. God, how long has it been? Um, about a month. <laughs> or three days. Yeah. A month, but like three well, days. Yes, three days. Um, so this is actually a gift from my husband. I opened it up. Oh, I'm showing a little. We just had a mini uh, photo shoot, and I don't think I told Cameron in the job description that she would be taking a lot of my Instagram photos. <laughs> So, um, but we did it, yeah. and um, so tell everyone, how is it like working for me? Um, <laughs> I'm putting you on the spot. It's fun, <laughs> um, a lot of errands. Yes, a lot of errands that, good. that I don't want to do. Thank yeah. you for doing them. <laughs> and look, time. she brings me chocolate, so <laughs> she's, she's helping me stay healthy and um, you know, have maybe have a few like uh, love handles after she's done. <laughs> But, um, all right, thank you. I just no. made her stop. We just took, a <laughs> we were just taking photos. I'm like, Cameron, come back. Thank you, Cameron. No, bye. All right, see you next week. I just totally put on their spot. I don't know why I did that. It's kind of rude, but she's so sweet. And uh, now it's time to um, dive into some chocolate and uh, watch a lot of reality television. Oh, by the way, you guys, um, um, I binge watched 
this show that I'm so hooked on. Okay, so uh, you guys may not know this, but my biggest number one guilty pleasure, other than obviously like wine and sweets, is um, reality television. I, I watch it all from Marriage Boot Camp to um, Married at First Sight. Oh my gosh, that's so good. Oh, 90 Day Fiance. Um, there's so many, but I recently started watching Love After Lockup. It follows couples who met in jail, like the one person's in jail, but the other person isn't, and it follows their lives after the person gets out of jail. And it is so riveting, and it's such good reality TV. I watched five hours last night. What? Oh yeah, let me just get uh, put this stuff down, I'll pay you. <laughs> Um, it's so riveting and so addicting for so for those of my fellow reality TV show addicts like myself you've got to watch it it is so good um, oh, my arms getting tired all right you guys that's it for today it was fun you know what you got to let me know did you like this because I've never done a day in the life I never vlog um, so you need to tell me if you like it or if I need to stop because I'm gonna be listening to you guys so please let me know in the comments below thank you so much for watching and if you haven't subscribed please do so right now and uh, that's it bye